Hey. Hey. <laughs> hello, hello. Yes. Hello. So yeah, we are on our day five of our CBG do do all day day, and today Miu is going to continue with his Tokyo Pig game. Hey, yes. So right. <laughs> after day four, I have not done anything on my <laughs> Tokyo Pig game. So it, today is going to be me, me my turn. What? <laughs> okay. On day four, I actually did not do much as well. But okay, before. Before we eventually start developing, let's say hello to everyone. Miu. Mm -hmm. Yes. Hello, Star. Hello, Ron. Hello, Movie XP. Hello, Sido. Hello, PJ. And then earlier we have and hello, Sack. And also, Big Boy was here earlier, but right now I think Big Boy is already in school. Yep. Enjoy yeah. your school. <laughs> How is? Uh. <laughs> okay, Star. Um, how is everyone said I'm ongoing actually? I think, yeah. How many? Star. How many have <laughs> have, have already submitted? I I, I know like a, a couple of that like post post the update on Discord that they have submitted the game. So right now we have got around um, how many submissions? Let me check. Nine submissions actually. Wow. Yeah. Now we. Okay, so we we'll expect more. Yes, nice. Mission. Yeah, we will have more, like at least two from me and like one from Ron. <laughs> Wait, two, Ron from, <laughs> two from you? <laughs> no pressure at all. Two from us. Oh, okay, okay. I thought you were gonna submit like two games. Oh boy. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not. Hello. <laughs> yes, another day when Javix, no progress. No, 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 no. Today I will plan. And I will watch Mew, and I will share for everyone. Yeah. Uh -huh. So okay, let's discuss what we are going to do today, Mew. All right, let's switch to the gym board. So today, yes. on day five, um, so the plan is going to do these three things. Uh, yeah. Hopefully, <laughs> hopefully I can finish all three. So. Right now, my game only have uh, this decklet um, that I can try to avoid. But they are moving at a constant speed all the time. And that is not really exciting when you play the game for a long time. So I want to add a speed path and also a speed mechanic so that um, things will go faster as the times go. But also if you collect the speed path, like you move faster and then you gain point. Mm -hmm. Yes. So right now you can see the the green box. It actually measures the, the distance you have traveled, and also we have the um, distance mark on the ground, um, saying that how much you have traveled. So this number will go uh, up faster when we collect like a speed pan. Ooh, and hi, a random cube. Uh, hello, a I random cube. You, you know what? Actually, okay, before I actually submit the no before i actually released no actually when i when i released the J Jam game uh -huh. the squad party one i asked me to play it and and we thought a random cube character was a train i mean it moved on like a straight line right and then it, it actually flow by like another character so at that point i thought wait, wait are they like following each other so it looked like a train Oh yeah, the truth. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. But how are you going to build a speed pad? So I think the first thing. Okay, let me. Uh. Okay, I just stay with this first. So I think the speed pad is going to be the same as like Diglett. Uh, like it will move to the board, <laughs> but actually like the spark is like a lot less frequent. And then when it hit. Uh, our tokepi, then we can increase speed. So I think it's like come hand to hand. Uh, like I have to actually make it so that um the decklet and also like everything move at a different speed. Okay, let me wish. Are you doing a train right now? 
No. Why are you so mean? All right. <laughs> Actually, so, today, like, I plan, like, to revamp some of my quotes as well while Mew is working, but right now I'm procrastinating <laughs> and I'm just drawing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, right now, all, all these, like, object speed, like, is controlled by a map. Like, this one is, like, from 1 to 3, which is, um, if I allow it to move, it will go like, a 3 unit. And if not, then it's going to be 0. And this is also, um, the speed for this moving object is 3 again. And so I want to change to have like a, a counter that can actually, uh, like control the speed. So this counter will also like control the game state as well. Like for example, if um, this counter is 0, okay, this, okay, this, so this will be our speed. Let me put the first comment. <laughs> Ooh, the first comment. The, no, the first no, comment, no, no. Do you usually like what put like it like hover the nodon or do you prefer like having like one line? I prefer bit? to put over like a box and then after that I click lock button so that it will not move. Ah, uh, but yeah, you can actually, actually today I'm not going to ask me so many questions. <laughs> Why? <laughs> <laughs> because during the day I have asked so many questions already. It's okay, so, but yeah, you can ask me any question except the one that you asked um, in the during <laughs> the day. I may not be able to uh, I may not be able to answer it actually. <laughs> but this is going to so be our speed. So the day speed. was like I had to interview other people, so oh. like I actually had to ask so many questions. Uh huh. Like for example, okay. you. Mm -hmm. Why do you decide to add comment not on here? Uh it's for fun. <laughs> Oh my it's god. So fun. Do you know that it costs one nodon? Yes, but it's I can expensive. remove it later. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so this one will be on <laughs> should I read on change of zero? Yes. And when the counter is zero, everything should stop. And when it's go to one, then I can move at like three speed. And then when it's four, then I I want to try to actually have like uh, this kind of speed curve. Okay, let me go back to the to the board. <laughs> Wait, there's so many character right now on the board. Yeah, I'm still resting. So <laughs> no, today <laughs> I'm resting a bit. I just got the booster shot today. Wait, really? Wow. Uh, okay, okay. Yes. Yeah, you should you should rest a lot today. So I have like this, like um. So this one is going to be uh, speed and this one is going to be like a counter value and it starts from zero and then at one, two, three, like I can move at like three, maybe, I don't know, 3.5 mm. so at zero it's going to be like zero and then it's going to move up to one and then after that it's going to be <laughs> some linear path i see what are the number one two three again what is this counter for for the for the speed i mean it's the value of a counter and the actual speed the oh uh -huh. so the counter keeps increasing when you collect the speed yeah so it's also increased when you um, get the speed pad, but also it will also increase over time. Oh. I think for the for the speed pad, um, it will have another uh, property is that the the character the Togepi will actually walk closer to you. I see, I see. Mm -hmm. So you can see it like a more close up, but if you get hit. Um, by a leaflet, then like you kind of like move back. Will the speed get slower or no? It will. Be, it will when either be hit. stop, but I want. I might want. I I might try to like reset the speed when you get hit. Hmm. Oh. That that could also be a possibility. So you have to like start over from the small speed. Okay. Mm hmm. Yeah. Okay. Let's get started. Let's get started. 
Yes. And hi, not not. Uh, hello, not also not cool not. GPT creators. All right, so I have. Some person looks kinda hard. <laughs> Mm. Oh, I have this counter and then. Don't worry, Mew will make it look easy for you. Hmm? What do I you like... mean? <laughs> what do you mean? <sighs> oh, you mean the graph? The speed graph? Um, Mew will make coding look easy. Oh, I wish I had that when I am teaching. <laughs> <laughs> so. <laughs> so I think. For the speed, if I increase by like one every time, and then after that I increase by three, by like using the map to add three when the counter is not zero, that could work. But I would try to like use two map. Like for one counter, I increase the speed by wait five. Okay, let's try that. What happened to your screen now? <laughs> <laughs> now you have now you can so you can see like Jay can switch screen between the GBG and also like her iPad. I need to think. Okay, like I'm planning for my game again. Ah, I actually wait. I thought you have only oh, have a new plan. So, yeah, I I think usually coding coding does not take so much time, but like. Planning takes a lot of time for me. Ah, yeah. I see, I see, I see. So like, I have to think. Ooh. Hmm. But for the current oh. game, in your current game, right? So the speed is constant, isn't it? Yes. So are you going to um increase the speed first before adding the speed pad? Yeah, or, I think I I want to I try that first, because adding a speed pad would like just like copy delete and then change texture, and then I wire uh -huh. I wire the touch sensor to the map uh, to to the counter. So hmm. actually, when the speed increases, the thing that moves faster would be delete, right? And also the next Declet. speed pad. Oh, and also the next speed pad, and also the number. And also yeah, the number, number on the screen. Pads. Yeah. Ah. So I have, okay. Yeah, I kind of have two map here. The but one. Right now, hmm? where do you store the speed of the ticket? There is no speed. Oh, I mean, it's the map. Like I have, I have counter to, to toggle right. Um, whether or not I yeah. want it to move or not. And yes. then it, it's connected to a map. So. It's going to but be right like. Yeah, but then I, I have a, a different speed here. Okay, okay. I, think I, should, I should do this. Okay. Oh, this is a speed counter. Mm. Okay, I lock. Okay. And then I can wire the output here to. I change this map to be like a multiply. Hmm. Okay. Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. That's what like, I was confused about because currently it's a map. So when it's a map, right, you cannot really change mm -hmm. the value inside mm -hmm. as the time passes. Yep, that's true. So, yeah. So I wish... Okay, let me check this map connected to here. Right, okay. Yeah, I have to make sure that oh, I connect like, to the same place. Oh my god, there's... Yeah, there, you know what? Like, there's so many things. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we have inverse. What was hmm. that inversion? Not on for I get all that inversion is for um stopping. Yeah, yeah. You know what? Mew I think you can keep the map. But um it's going to be costly. I mean what I mean is you just keep the map that does nothing. The map that does nothing? Yeah. If you don't want to like we draw those three lines again, but hmm. oh, so maybe just like yeah, the map. No, no, no. Maybe just change to like multiplication. Actually, just I remember the location I, of those three lines. Okay, let me see. So the inverse here will it is one make it to zero, and also this yeah. this thing. What? What's that? Line Ano for? Another in wait. 
Why is it the same anymore? So this I in think that's one This one inverse is like when I touch a flop ball. Oh right? and then I set a timer yes. and then I inverse. Okay, so Ah, okay, okay, okay. So Wait, but also A. Oh, A is a game end. Mew, Mew hasn't called it for a while and like, Mew forgets. What is mm. A for? Oops, oops. Ah, so do you think, <laughs> in should take note though, like, um, what are the wormholes? What, like, what each? Ah, hello, Mew. Oh. Called? Hi, Mr. O. No, it's okay. It's only like one. <laughs> No, but like this one is for the the game end. So again, like because like this uh minus um oh I see. So instead of putting it here, I can put it to A. It will act the same as getting hit, because after the game end, I want everything to stop moving. So I use A to inverse and then. Uh huh. Okay. So I don't actually don't need this. I can move here to or or of them to A. Okay. Let's try first. I might make my own game, but it's good for science. Okay. Let's try. What's, <laughs> What's an excuse? Oh, if I got hit. Wait. It's not moving. Stop moving. Wait. It does not stop moving. Anymore. So, when I got hit, I have the output for the timer for five seconds. I put this inward. Oh, I got it. I don't need this inward because I already inward here. Uh, ah. So I can try to get it to here. unknown. And then, where did this go again? To a oh no, Mr. O, take care. Wait, what happened? Oh. Mr. O has not slept again. You should sleep, you should sleep. Yeah. I mean, you are famous for like, um, being like a moon knight. <laughs> but I mean, like, he is actually an eye, so like, with mm, no eyelid. So yeah. he never his eye. <laughs> I know, I know. <laughs> he stays awake all the time. Uh, hello, someone unknown. Yes. Okay. Glad to see you here, someone unknown. Okay, this should work theoretically. No. <laughs> what is different? So I have one here for the counter. I add. So when I got hit, I have like one. Hmm. Oh, but I think, yeah, I will use the different wormhole then. Like A for game end, but like B for, uh, getting hit by a flop ball. Yeah. Okay. Because can you help? It's so different. A from game end. I will help you not. <laughs> game end. B for. Getting hit by fluff ball. Yep. Okay, let me put this up a little bit so that I can put B here to be the entrance and everything on this side. Okay, so we we'll connect to to not. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. And this not connect to to. Oh, because if I got hit, I cannot. Uh huh. I cannot move. So. Wait. Are you using the map as and? I don't think Mew is using map as and. Mew is using map for um mapping the state of the declared to its speed. Right? Is my understanding correct? Yeah, I would use Mew. I might use map as an and. and... No, no, as 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 of current state. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Yeah. Yeah. There's so many things connected to not. 
I feel like Mew might have to restart his <laughs> his programming. I mean, you have this one. You copy, you copy the code before you eventually edit it, right? Mm -hmm. Did you? Okay, okay, okay. Mew, Mew, delete this and restart over. We continue. But I, yeah, I haven't changed anything except the map. Oh, because I haven't connected B2 map yet. Okay. Okay, the B2 map. Mm -hmm. The B2 map. Okay, B2 map. Okay. Oh, actually, I have to forward to inverse. Okay. Because um, it's no longer inverse. So I have to do the inverse first. Yes. And then I convert this inverse to the map. Hmm? Oh yeah, <clears throat> I see. The actually the first like the the left did that is bug, but the other is not. Yeah. The left ticket just, <laughs> just, just turn its back against I know. us. I'm not sure why. Oh, only the first one. Yeah, only, only the first one. And hi, 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 SMG6. SMG6 video. Oh, hi, hi, hi. S SMG6 video, do not spam, okay? Yeah. Yep. No spam. I said your message. And, and also family friendly message. Okay, so I have... Wait, where am I? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I have this, like, um, as... Like, connected to map. Which means that, uh... So this will be... Actually want it to be, like... Uh... So it's minus one, but with one from the map, it's going to be zero. And then the minus one is going to be zero. So I have to connect like three things to this map and also to uh, to the speed. But I want to change it to like multiply. So it's either going to be um, zero or one. So I can change this the map to do nothing like, like 0 to 1 so that I don't want to like connect all those 3 again Re reducing the share that I will break it and then I will add a multiply so right now like the game start immediately when I start the game yeah mm -hmm, okay Good. Suddenly you become quiet. <laughs> I was like, mm, did I lose you? <laughs> and no. I can do I'm listening to you carefully, Mew. Oh, okay. Okay, so I need. I'm pretty less. Um, I'm definitely asking less questions. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. You can, you can think more about your game. Like, oh I, my god! I... Mew says, like, that's good. It mean. It's mean. Please be quiet. <laughs> why do you, why do you think that? Happen. I mean, you can yeah. you can spend time make, like making your game as well. That's a win-win situation. That's <laughs> Please mind your own business. Why did it become negative? Why did it always become negative? Oh, okay. So I remove. Uh, yes, and then I connect to here. And I think for this, so I have. Wait, what happened here? I want I want to have like button press X to start. With this ah. oh. mm. button press X on press or so press X to start. But it can only start when Everything is the speed is zero. 
actually have a counter for the game stand. Like, title, um, I should, right? Yeah, usually, usually, I think you should have a counter and then map it to the move marker node on. Yeah. Uh huh. So that you can read, like, um, when the counter is one, you will show the title screen and, like, visible or the control. And when the counter is two, you mm. have to. Yeah. Yeah. You will enable the input and the game will start. I actually think it's better to set up that. Hmm. But actually, for, for now, let, 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 let me try to, like, test. Press X to increase the value and then see if the speed go up first. Yeah, before. you can you can <laughs> change to other button like for example button A because hmm? if you use other button like button A, you can actually test in the programming screen. But like oh. use any buttons, you yeah. you can use any buttons that are not shortcuts in the programming screen. So what are what are the button for shortcut? <laughs> I well, never knew. When you press X, you can, uh, switch, yeah, yeah. I can, you can switch between like X Y and X C, and the button Y is for opening the settings, so you should not oh, use those okay. buttons. Okay. So maybe CL. Testing. Okay. Yeah. CL works. So. Yeah. So now when you press CL, the counter will increase. Uh huh. And also, I want it to do the start random. So right now, like, I I check against the game over. So still with the game over, like the not from ah hmm? So I want to press CL to start and as well as uh start the timer. So the wormhole A is for game end, right? Yes, for game end. And if it not end, then I do the start. And also, yeah, display the number. Like for for this, is like I press A so that I can spin, and then I have a counter for collecting point. Okay, let me yeah. do that. Right. So what are you going to do now? For oh, this counter for right. For oh, so you're going to add comments. Point. Yeah, just add, adding comment first. Ah, actually, what are you trying to achieve here? So what I'm trying to do is to SCL to like start everything and uh, I don't want the top I, I don't want it to maybe I can use flag here for uh the uh the the randomize I think flag work flag works yeah it depends though like if if and you have many states I, in your game uh, then Yeah, then marker is better. I used flag. Oh, okay. So when the flag Wait. is on, it starts. You a. You a means game end, right? And the flag means game start. Okay. Hmm. So it's the opposite of each other. So. If yeah. It, if the game starts. So right now, what we are trying to do is like. Previously, the game starts when I start um, the game. When when A sends to not. Hmm. When, when the game is not A. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Hmm. And now we come CL. Okay. Yeah, and then it's like right, 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 right now it's not uh, randomizing, and then when I press CL, it start randomizing. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, that works. That looks great. Yeah. Yeah, let me connect. Try in a game game screen as well. 
<laughs> I want to see like what happens before the game eventually starts. Does everything really stop, or is it just your imagination right now? Okay, let me let me wipe everything here. So right now, like this, these are the speed, right? These are the speed. Right now, it's not uh... activated. When I press CL, yeah. So it it it, it it's going to start moving. But it's not going to start at the same time because it also have this map that's connect to the counter to the toggle for each of the uh each of the dick that. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. Hmm. Okay. Let's try. So right now, oh, okay. I forgot about the speed here. I think the game starts no, even no, no, before no. you press CL. No, because I I haven't. Put the speed for um the number. Oh okay. Yeah, so and right now hey. it's a constant three. Ah, uh, hey, Shanky. Hi, Shanky, the waffle cat, and yeah, PJ. I hope you, PJ sister. I hope you enjoy the um toy dumpling. And PJ, it's talking about Sonic. Hmm. Mm, actually, I, because like these are like two wire, I would just use S for speed. So that okay. they are less uh it's for speed. Mm -hmm. mm. Yeah, let's change let's change B to F for football. <laughs> B to F for football. And then uh. A to E. For end game. What is F for again? So what F, is F for football? F means getting hit by football. by football. And then E is D. I got hit three times by football. So e F. is getting hit three times. E is game end. Yeah, game end. Okay. So let me remove all this Y. And then I use S to only have one wire. I mean. The the connection is really cheaper than the Donon, but for readability. Why why do we have two maps? Because from the speed counter. It's not linear. It's a piecewise linear. Uh huh. Uh -huh. <laughs> why do we need piecewise wise linear again? I well, think because I, the you drew that. Yeah, you have to run that on your. Mm. Um, Jamboard, but I still don't understand like why do you want piece wise? Because I don't want speed to double too quickly. Like if we use uh a linear pad, it has to have the y intercept at zero, right? Uh-huh, yes. So if we want the slope to be less than one. Maybe you have to draw. Okay. Bigger one. Sure, sure, sure. Let me send to. Because, because, actually, I mean, um, I think many of us do not understand what is piecewise and what is linear. Mew. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> so I have and this. Hey, thank you, Shanky, the waffle cat. What is the your the the counter value? Comment. And this is the speed. Okay, wait. I have to switch my. Into the bot. So I have counter value and a speed. And what I yes. want to achieve is that uh, until the counter is one, right? The speed is going to be three. Linear. Right? So this is going to be my first piece of the linear. Like this is the, the the line, right? From zero zero to like one three. Okay, so this means so from, so the counter will automatically increase right as the game passes. Yes, and the counter only the speed increases. Only increase. mm -hmm. The speed increases because the game is getting more and more difficult, so things move faster. Mm -hmm. Right. That, that, okay. Right. Yeah. So at two, I want it to be three point five. Why from one to two the speed 
increases slower. Because I don't slowly. want I don't want to double the speed like otherwise you double the speed do like make the speed go faster. Oh it will quicker. be too fast? Yeah it will be too fast. Like right now three is relatively fast. And if you send ah. six three six uh three to six it's going to be impossible. So actually on X axis it is actually the, the time. So as time passes the speed would slowly increase. Yeah, the counter will yeah. increase, and if you got hit, then the yeah. counter will set to one. Oh, or maybe like if you get okay. hit, then the counter go back to like mm. minus one. Oh, like minus one or mm -hmm. something like that. Okay. Yeah. So we have like got this gotcha. two line, but we actually oh, need. Oh yeah. Yeah, the different slope. So, so this one is the the first map, and then this one is the second map. Ah, so for these two map, we have to like restrict the range, right? No, only for the first one. Hmm. Yes, only for the first one. Restrict the range. Okay. Mm, yeah, which I al already did that for the first one. Uh -huh. oh, so let, let me let me switch. So it's the correct one. <laughs> yeah, the first one is from one to two point five. So that the uh, the second one when it's become one, then it's actually point five. It increased by point five every time. Mm. Mm, okay. <gasps> Movie XP said nice procrastinating. After getting hit, does it does it reset to zero or one? Asked <laughs> Sir Tolurian. It will be I can do I, I can reset it to zero first. And because after getting hit there is an animation of getting hit. Oh. When I finish the animation, then I can send the one to one. Mm. Okay. Um. But yeah. Yeah, but, it is. I don't understand now. But the, the, definitely, why I, I need... has this question. Because just now you mentioned that okay, when after getting hit, the speed might get decreased by like one, but eventually, I mean, you have to stop everything for a short moment. The the stopping is actually a different. Like because right now I'm, I'm using multiply, right? There are two factor: the speed factor ah. and the condition factor. If we get hit, I change the condition factor. I didn't change the speed factor, and so it will be hi, stop no matter what. Hi, sec. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Hmm? Yeah. Will you have to switch? Oh. Um. Scene. Okay. So I just wait. Let me make it back. Okay. I have to memorize that I have to connect correctly. Right. Yes. Mm, okay. <laughs> Karma is like asking like 18 past question. <laughs> <laughs> have you tried vodka or sake? Actually, have you tried? I have tried, but I don't, I don't, usually don't drink a lot, though I don't drink that much. I try yeah. sake. Like, it's, it's like for for New Year actually. There is like amasake. The what is amasake? The rice. Yeah. Rice. The rice. The rice like uh -huh. yeah, yeah, rice wine or something like that. Yeah, it's like sweet because of the name like ama means sweet amai. Ooh, yeah. Okay, so I paid CL. Ah, and now everything is flat, which means that. Ah, the first one is no longer bug. <laughs> oh, come! I don't what know. What did you do to fix the bug? <laughs> I did not Actually, we haven't done anything. <laughs> oh my gosh. The bug just got fixed. Yup. I mean, I think it's, yeah. it's because of the... the uh, when I... When I... When I... Did... Like this... 
randomization maybe they actually like send the signal to like to, to, to start I'm not sure if that is the case like it actually go before it actually uh, hmm. I have to I have to like inspect that but I, I have not hit this bug for like a while but I have not actually have time to uh, to actually see what is the cause but now it fixed by having the start button <laughs> <laughs> it's like okay it's something like Wait, okay is, is it that happened to you suddenly the button is fixed Okay, let me pay. I mean, yeah, it happens all the time, even in real life. It, it's it, like suddenly the button is now faster. Like... It's now faster now. I can press CL. Ooh. Then it's got to faster. Press CL, CL. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's. It moves so fast. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Bill, Bill die. Oh, and Togepi got one hit. Bill Togepi got. Will it get. So, the like, hit. the bug occurred. So, the speed does not automatically increase. No. Do you have to press CL? Yes, yeah, yeah, I have to press CL. Um, Karma, actually, let's not talk about those things. Like, like. Hmm, um. it's not family friendly. Yeah. Okay, so I think. With a fast speed, there there come an issue, right? Because I have seen the bug actually occur more often when it at high speed. Hmm. <laughs> I actually, I actually want to see the glitch at like at maximum speed, like what it looks like. <laughs> yeah, because like, like I, I I can try to increase the speed and then. And sometimes you can see uh, one of the diglets might actually like uh, spin. Like when when it turn back, it means that it actually got it's actually bug. So yeah, when when at, high, when at at high speed, it will have like some a little bit of time before it actually gets slow, like one frame. Okay. But it's beautiful movies. Is it the ticket? I mean the the movie uh, the the ticket moving at high speed, right? <laughs> 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 oh. I actually enjoy seeing, um, yeah, ticket moving at high speed. It's going to be fun. Yeah, I think it it it, it might be because of the size, but I would I would fix it later. Uh, right now the size is actually not proportional so but the moving object might actually like try to spin and when it spin the the, the touch sensor it might get back sometime hmm. which I have to <laughs> investigate it later yeah let's actually when there is a move maybe I, I should use like uh, line because right now it actually it activate the first the first one already but the speed is zero but I think it's okay hmm be fine yeah so let's try again let me keep the speed a bit faster and see if I see any bugs. I want to make sure that okay, um, everything stops. I can help you play test. Oh. Mm. Okay, so this thing actually like move backward a little bit. Uh -huh, I see. So because of your speed sensor, come back and try to put it here trying to hmm this moving object actually is not uh is not solid 
the cards is actually overlap with all of these solid moving objects. So I have to do like some inverse inversing speed when uh like this F the F is like getting hit by uh F is getting hit by, by fluff ball. ball. And okay, yeah, I think maybe it's Shanky the waffle cut. Yeah, I think it's quite complex and Mew is getting confused by his own code. I'm pretty sure. <laughs> no, <laughs> Ross Ro Ro oh says it's. it's... <laughs> <laughs> Wait, Ross Ro says it's looking good. <laughs> yeah. Okay, it looks so. Looks good. Okay, so the speed will increase um, over time. So maybe after this number object, right? This number object, like hit the hit the the finish line the the object uh the fancy object in the back and like restart to the front then i can increase the speed every like say like 10 meters yeah 10 units so from here i have i have connect this moving object with 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 with, with uh a number object and this number object actually hit uh okay this is a texture oh wait 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 this teleport e okay i have to fight the teleport e here and then oh okay okay the the touch sensor is actually in the middle so when this touch sensor activate i can increase the speed by cutting up okay okay so i start and then when it hit okay so it start to get faster you can see the dig like, in the middle actually like it might actually fall off the ground somehow the best oh i mean fall off the ground really Maybe I'm I'm not even I'm not sure yet. I have to investigate on my own time. But you can see it actually go faster, right? Yes. You can actually make the speed go up even faster during the test period. Uh huh. But this one is already pretty fast. Ah, got hit by once. Yeah, you can see some of the dicklet actually like rotate. That's actually a bug. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> this is so fast. Yeah, mo most, most of the time for like making game, it will be like try to play test. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah. Yeah. So like why my game dev is slow is usually like, let's say, after I make one chicken, I would just there at that chicken, the chicken for a really long time and then you move, you move around and then you flap let it flap the wing okay bye bye karma bye have bye, fun karma. on your volleyball practice and you can teach us how to play volleyball next time okay let me try actually change one of the map to but if let's form two to one i can make it like one to one so that it actually like one to two to make it the speed go fast for the testing period uh, and now let and let me try to fix this. Glad to see you here. The bug that they did that they like spin. Mm. Cause why why was it spin? Yeah, I'm not sure. <laughs> but uh, you have to find the cause. <laughs> but I mean, it's not happening all the time. It happens yeah. sometimes. That the difficult part, right? When Let's, there are some new people coming. Let's say hi Sam and uh, hi, hi Roslip. Hi hi hi. Yeah, right now we're And also PJ sister. Up. Hi. <laughs> yeah. But I'm trying to. And Sam, I love the new intro. Yeah, the new letter screen is pretty cool. Go up to it. Make it go up in the y direction to it. 
So initially, the Diglett. Okay, let me draw the Diglett. We have. Mm -hmm. Okay, so right now it's actually a cylinder here. Cylinder connected to a sphere on the top. And like right now, it's like here is 0 0.4 the height of the cylinder, and the radius of the circle is actually like 0.8. But the moving object is actually in the bottom, and the the weight is actually more on like the the head, the top part. So I want to increase uh this to like the same height as the circle. And also change some of the texture. Okay, let's try. What textures do you want to change? Uh, probably the like the from mouth, the, the nose, the nose part. Right, right now it. Uh, actually in the middle here, I want it to actually because. Uh, how should I say it? Like the. Because this the height of the texture is 0.8, but the actual height of the cylinder is 0.4, so it's actually get some of the portion of the texture on it. So if I want to use the full height, but I actually want to display half height, then I have to shift the nose down. Uh, 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 uh. Wow, so you're going to add animation to the clip, right? Uh, yes. Maybe, yeah. <laughs> Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, right now, right now I, I make it static first. Okay, and then I change it to center to center. Yes. But, yeah, initially. After that scene, Mew. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. So I increase the height. And then I change the connection uh -huh. to center center so so that everything is balanced. Like oh. if everything is balanced, the bug might go away. I'm not sure, but the that's in my might hypothesis. Go away. So right now Mew is trying to fix the bug where the grid sometimes spins around, like sometimes rotates. Uh -huh. Yeah. Actually, I can do something like this. And then, uh, uh, uh. Uh, I can. Okay, let me. All oh, rose slip is actually side dog. Hmm? Wait. How come you are. Wait, eh? Wait, what happened? <laughs> I'm confused by chat. Rose slip say, Sorry, I am side dog. My phone was really dead, so I used my sis phone. But oh. then Saido also replies, Yeah, I know. So like I'm confused. <laughs> so I like how come Roslip says Roslip is at school, but Saido lives in the same time zone as me, which is um so right now it's like 10 pm. So oh. like I'm I cannot confused. Yeah, I'm I'm confused uh, as well. Yeah. Okay, yeah. so ask are the teleporters set to reset? Uh huh. Yes, to reset. That's right. Yes. Ooh. Hmm? Why? What happened? Yeah, we realized that Not Not has been aware for forty one minutes. Yeah, we miss you, Mister Not Not. Yeah, I'm doing yeah. the nose. Hmm. <laughs> So now chat can we need the perfect Diglett nose. Perfect Diglett nose. Alright. This is going to be perfect. And then I have to delete delete the upper part. Ooh. Movies today you finish school quite early. It's like it's only 3 pm. And I think Yeah. Actually I wonder. Huh? What time do you do chats always finish school? I don't know. I feel like when I was young, right? I usually finish school pretty late. Like at least 4 or 5 p.m. I'm not sure what about you, Mew. 
Only four, right? It's four like p.m. Like in the sand. Three forty-five. I thought, I think, uh, in high, middle school is like four thirty, and then when I come high school, like three forty-five. Oh, that's early. Yeah, I think usually it's like four ish for me, four ish p.m. And like after that, usually, like my friends and I would go to the tuition school. Until like eight or nine p.m. Ah, so it's like it's always a long day for me when I was in school. Yeah. Oh, so I have to change. Wait, do I have to? Yes, I have to. So this texture also have to change. Why? 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 Because I only need half. Really? Like, can you show what oh. that texture? Yeah. Right. So right now it's like like this. <laughs> oh. oh yeah yeah so <laughs> uh and also like i can have that but okay i can have first yes and then i need a a, a different texture for the the top of the uh, the the sphere because the 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 sphere is cannot use this half anymore because it has to be full right otherwise we have like mm -hmm. the that with with hats where that's pretty cool Mew ah uh, hold on so this is not for Y why not Y plus yes X yeah so half wait half but Ah yeah 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 that that's correct and then I have to have a full one for so this one is going to be the body I mean everything is a body but the lower part of the body and the upper <laughs> part of the body yeah actually I wonder how long is your Easter holidays has Easter holidays already started for movies and Saido how come your sister is still at school. Um, when it is 10 p.m. Wait, 10 p.m.? Yeah, 10 p.m. for him. F yeah. That's... Wait, this... Are you sure? <laughs> I mean... Yeah. They might, they might have like... Oh, is it a boarding school? Or is it not? I don't know. I... Actually, I was in... I think the latest I have been to tuition school is like 9.30 Yeah I think so mm -hmm. But this one is everything but not the minus Yeah Now, oh no I got hit Okay ah. The speed will be increased Good. very fast <laughs> Oh but the Okay No <laughs> Actually, I, I have to make it immortal so I can see uh, Dig that at high speed. Let me change the counter. The spheres connected to the cylinder's center to center. Yes. Arcs. So yes. I change yes. it to center okay. to center now. Where am I? Okay. The counter, I, I count down and then I check it to. Oh, I have a map to check the end game. It's, if it's negative 3. So maybe I never go to end game. <laughs> to make to make my okay be immortal. I mean I still got hit but Ah But it it, it will continue. Let's see if, if there is a bug when the dick that actually like move. Oh my god. Oh my god, he's so fast. I wonder if... <sighs> okay, I think there's no bug. Even with ha. this speed. It's super fast. Oh my god, <laughs> I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> no, not saying. that's so cool. And like, ah. how you're talking to me, never died. 
because I disconnect. It's HP. It's already like zero. No, oh, I, I, I disconnected. Yeah, I disconnect to the end game. Yeah. Otherwise, yeah. Okay. Maybe range limit map Less so limit. that it does not become impossible. No, but I want the game to end right for the endless run. <laughs> So I mean, he wants the game to be impossible. No, but like, if, <laughs> if you want to go, I mean, for the end of run, right? If you keep the same speed, right? And you never make a mistake, then you will get ball. Are you? <laughs> Are you not? He would get bored, yeah. At yeah. some point, the game should end. But yeah, right. So, maybe, may not be this early. No, like, but just yeah. now the speed increased. No, because so, it's, it's for so testing. Fast. I mean, for testing. I oh, it's for testing. Okay. Like double the counter. So the slope actually wow. goes twice. But in the actual game, it's actually half. Like 2 to 1. Okay. Is it a 1 to 2? And you die by like getting 3 hit. Okay. So I think <gasps> everything works perfectly now. Wait, you have a different egg now? <laughs> oh yeah, I'm, I'm going to... And, and really this like... The egg from last time, it look bad. I mean, it look, it look like, look a, a, like a, a... That that like plastic flower. It looks like darts. Like darts. Darts that you throw. Do you know like... There's like a plastic flower that uh, you make... Um, for the... Uh, for a necklace? I know, I know, I know. Yeah. It's actually, it's actually based on the real flower, okay, Mew? Yeah, it's actually based on the real flower, but like in school, they only use like the fake one to help, like to, to, to actually help you study about it. So that flower is called... What is it? What's the name? Dahlia. Dahlia? Okay. I never know the name, actually. Yeah. I also never know the... <laughs> I also so never know the English name. I have just googled. <laughs> oh, but you know, but Do you, you know the Thai name of that flower? Is it uh Mali? No. No. Mali is Jasmine. The bloom, right? Ah, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Okay, Wait, what's the name? Is, okay. <laughs> yeah, I tell you later. Okay, sure. <laughs> so now but everyone know that I'm not. How you say is um. Ah, okay. Would like. You mentioned it's Dahlia. Dahlia, okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Wait, okay. wait, right now the BGM is Pokemon songs. <laughs> that's right, that's right. I think... Th wait, are you, are you picking the BGM or is it everyone? This, this time I picked the BGM. Ah, okay. Yeah. Because we are making a Pokemon game. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. Alright, okay. So we have the speed working. <laughs> oh this that half the task. Oh my god. I need okay, I have to do the speed pad. I feel like this turn or not is a bit sarcastic here. I feel like they have done more progress <laughs> than last time they Really? I only have got this. Just for day. this egg? <laughs> oh my god, this egg equal to like 2 hours of stream last time <laughs> on, on day 4. <laughs> okay, let's, let's do a speed pad. I think for the speed pad, I can just use um, a fancy object. Uh, so I can still use the UFO. Wait, no, 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 not UFO. I mean, I can use the same setup. Here, okay. A teleport exit. Where is the Okay, teleport exit is here. So let me try to make a simple. Uh, wait, teleport. Uh, become F. Okay. So I will try to make the speed pad using the arrow, fancy object. So we have a different object. So here I change. The flat ball to where's it? okay. So the the arrow. What is the shell of the arrow? Oh my god, that's so far. 
Ah, this could be. Wait, is the arrow this long? Okay, let me check. Let me see the arrow for myself first. Huh? Oh, I, I forgot to disable to make it visible. I think the arrow is usually um, oh. orthogonal to the. Okay, yeah. okay, 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 okay. Gotcha, it is gotcha. orthogonal to the floor, um, the exit plane. Oh, but the small that I can do is. Ah. <sighs> yeah, actually, the tutorials, all the tutorials take quite long to make. Um, I have to. Like, usually, okay, the first. Like, usually, I would come up with, like, really ugly code first. And then I try to simplify it. And then I redo the code again from the beginning. Uh huh. Before I do the recording. Uh, and then I repeat actually. Okay, let me let me save. Oh, oh yeah. I see. Because you, you, you just show your programming screen just now. The, no no the the game. The, the game cuts a lot. Okay, let me copy first. So I have this the, the speed it work on version three? Okay. Now maybe version four. Okay, now which means that I have to rotate on which axis? On C, okay. Uh, 90 degree, okay, so that it will not be orthogonal. Wait, wait, can I rotate here? What if I don't head here and then I use the connection? We we don't head back. Let me get solid. Ah, okay. So I can use this arrow. I think the size is about right. So because I flip, which means that y become x. So the width is point six, and then the c is point eight. Okay. So I have so I disable solid and okay have it actually have it visible and then for the move object I don't need a do I need a cylinder? No, I can make it a box so that I can have a control on the dimension. And then the x will be 0.6 to be the same size so i want this moving object to be the same size as my fancy object so the center of gravity will not change and then y would be 0.1 okay and then c.8 okay uh -huh, uh -huh. okay things start to come nicely and then i center uh -huh. to center okay, let me put this in here first and see no I so think I you need... have to rotate the, the arrow on no. um around the C I, axis. I I already did but when I connect this to the object the rotation here doesn't matter. Yeah. So which means that Yes I reset this I reset uh, uh, the fancy object and then I rotate on this instead on the moving object instead uh -huh. will it work? I think, I think it will work but I'm not sure let's take a look so right now we'll try to make the Wait, arrow parallel to the floor mm -hmm. so if I but what would be the Ah, but the Y. But actually, because the Y. Oh. Oh, it should work. Hello, but, revolving but, potato. But it it's actually the first time on the ground. Seeing you here. So. 
Yeah. And thank you for the following revolving potato. So yeah, today we are building a game, mm-hmm. and we will have more days of building the game. Yes, we did. We need more days. <laughs> usually, <laughs> we definitely need more days. So usually we we also play T B T games every Saturday, but for this weekend we have a special event called Egg the Jam. Mm-hmm. Yes, that's why we are building. We are making egg related. Game. Mm-hmm. Game today. What is yeah. the deadline again? Is it April sixteen? We still right? have time to join. Yeah, yeah. It's midnight. April, April sixteen. Mm-hmm. Can get more information here, or like you can join this call. Ah, yep. Yeah. Did Mister not not say? <laughs> My game is coming along very well, and then for Jaya is nice chicken model. Now it's chicken uh, and egg model. It has been a chicken model for like many days, Mister Not Not. <laughs> okay, so maybe I shouldn't make it hard by having the speed pad and in at the center. Only, or should I move it around? Have like three types. Okay, so if I touch the UFO, I teleport. Just mm-hmm. click, and also I reset the counter. Oh, that is BCD. Mm. So rotating this thing actually matter for connection object. Okay, oh, for the set. Rotation settings actually matter for connected object. For the axis normal to the plane where it is connected. I see, so if I connect center to center, it will reset, right? But if I connect it to like, let's say like y plus to y minus, and if my object is actually rotate around y axis, it will actually rotate. Right? Am I understand this correctly? Maybe we should change the stream title to be um. So <laughs> GBG master class. <laughs> yeah. And <laughs> Shanky the Waffle Cat, thank you. He says nice music. No, oh, it's actually it actually says nice music. Yeah. But Shanky the Waffle Cat uses different characters. Oh okay. I'm 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 reaching, rearranging this thing around, picture around. Maybe the texture on the right side and then the logic on the left side. Hmm. Okay. Uh, actually, let let let's just try like three. But. The randomize will actually be lower. So right now for for my diglet, it's actually on like one second timer. So maybe the speed pad is like five second timer. Like come out every five. Let me check. Is to see. Is it BCD? Okay, it's BCD. Okay, BCD. I connect everything, and then I have to copy the logic again. Okay, I can move this up a little bit. Which means, oh, okay, which means that this is going to be to have the same uh, logic as Diglett. Okay, which means that I can do, I can do 
the taco uh three taco for each one of them wait how many are there? okay 185 <laughs> so what so each of these will control the state of the of the arrows you control Ooh. the state of the arrow yes <laughs> so that's not only carry gbg he also carries the bgm <laughs> <laughs> it's the old lab it team. <laughs> so right now we are we are in the professor's third lecture. <laughs> That's why the BGM changes. Third lab team. <laughs> and then I do multiply again. Okay. So if I toggle, then I do the multiply. But if I got hit. Then I will not moving. Yeah. And also, when that the game ends, inversion neuron works pretty hard. <laughs> so many links. Like, there are some like so inversion new here is and the Professor version. Professor Max Roslip. Are you? Uh, <laughs> not yet. <laughs> it's gonna be a long Do way. You plan to be. Uh... Like the yeah, there are like three stages until we become a, a, a professor. I become a like mm. my my title will be like the shorter, shorter. Like from associate <laughs> to like assistant, and then to just hey, professor. Hey, music. Oh, hey, music. Yeah. Mu actually teaches. Programming, right? Uh, um, mm, yeah, in a at way. University. Yeah, in a way, yes. Okay, I move at C direction, right? Okay. I move at C direction. And I. Okay, so when I got hit, I reset the speed. I reset. Wait, I have to reset the correct one. I reset the toggle. Uh. Uh. Right, it's <laughs> not so painful. Uh. Alright, and now I can have. Can you use the same flag? For randomization. So I have another randomize. Uh, another timer. At <laughs> 5. Oh, because just woke up. Okay. You might. Oh, be awake by all this spaghetti. <laughs> yeah, come and enjoy spaghetti breakfast. Breakfast. Okay, so this flag will connect to the timer every five seconds. And I can try to use the same marker and blue eyes. Actually, yeah, I want to only have one path. Activated at a time, so I will change everything to not be overlapping. Oh, but it actually, it's actually pretty hard. Okay. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I have to connect this one to the randomize and also the map. Yeah, actually, I can put the map and the randomize over here. Make it more easier. To see. Uh huh. So I use this different randomization. You just. Yeah, put it here and also the timer, put it also here. Anyway, it had to be half. I'll put how many f okay so every five I okay that's correct and then do randomize I connected two map so right now it's 10 to 1 so there are many stages and I want it to be about the same as the side of one of these uh box Okay. I cannot change so the side manually. 
Okay, let me let me okay. So that, right now there are five stairs, right? One, two, three, four, five. Uh -huh. Ah, but I have ten. Which means that I can reduce the size by half up. Ah, so that's the, the trick I just learned from Twitter. By shrinking okay, shrinking the the Y, I can have more stages on the move marker. Okay. By the way, if you look on the on the screen on on the right of the screen, you can see a random image from um. Wait, Shanky what is the waffle cat? <laughs> what <laughs> is the image about? Waffle cat that has just posted on this card and asked. Who is this? I actually don't know who is this. But I well, yeah, I don't know either. Who is this? <laughs> okay, hmm. I can. Oh, but okay, it's gonna be four two four. The what is it? The left side. You actually appear more frequently than the middle. I mean the 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 Why? side. To make to make oh. stuff harder, because if it's in the center, then it could be easier to for you to like collect the speed pad. Okay, so each one of these will connect it to the toggle. But I have to zoom in. Ah, lock. Okay, one, two, and then three. Serena will try to randomize nice. um when to launch the speed pad. Okay, let's try. Right. Yep. I mean, is, is this the same logic? So I should be able to see the speed pad very soon. Yes. Any minute. Every five seconds. Wait, it's not coming. <laughs> yeah, it's bugged. It's bugged. No. Oh, because I have not Why connected. Why does it show up? I forgot to connect the speed. <laughs> okay, cool. Rugi mistake. Like multiply by zero, you never move. All right, all right. Okay, I have speed pad now. Oh, and then if I I have to have a different touch sensor actually. One for UFO and one for the panel. For the panel. Because if I touch the UFO, uh, UFO is actually the character, then I can increase the speed. But mm. for the panel, it just reset because it didn't touch the UFO. So I have UFO here and this one is going to be just the panel but actually I want the sub sensor to be at the same size wait if I connect it here I rotate no but because I connect center to center so I can use the same size right. it has to be the same size right even though I rotate the C axis 0.1 0.6 0.8 0.1 0.6 0.8 8. By one by six by eight. Let me make it visible first so I know that the dimension of the jump pad is correct before I do something else. Ah, okay, it's correct. So if I did wait, do I detect the UFO? Maybe I can increase the the Y, no, the X to make it taller so that I can detect the UFO. Uh huh, so X can be by it. And then I can do connect to the. Uh huh, so I can. Touch. Nice, 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 nice. Alright, so I can change. This to only pine now, and I copy, and then I make this to UFO.
Oh, the is it just uh exclamation mark and link? Not the YouTube. I don't know. Can't remember. Probably. YouTube, I think link. Finger. Link or <laughs> yeah, it, it, it one of those command. Oh, it's YT. Ah. <laughs> I see. I see. Hey, revolving potato. Welcome to oh, YouTube problem. chat. <laughs> <laughs> okay, UFO will also reset. Uh huh. And then I connect the UFO to the moving object. Oh. Revolving Potato, thanks for the subscription. Yes. It's actually on my channel. Yeah, we also do some oh. random gaming. You can try us on some random games random. sometimes as well. <laughs> Mostly GBG, but plus some random gaming. Rose Lip says, confused of what happened. Oh, I also want to have egg sandwich right now, Milsi. But my favorite sandwich is PB and J sandwich. Ooh. Yeah. You like more like sweet? I think. Sort sweet. of. Uh -huh. I love like French toast as well because um, I usually eat French, to French toast with honey or maple syrup. Oh. <laughs> I think you do not have bread for breakfast, right, Mew? Usually. Hmm. Yeah, usually not. Maybe I have it when I live alone, but not with my family. Yeah, so like since when I was with my parents, I usually have bread for breakfast. Yeah, I remember your mom, uh, like... It's quite unusual for people in Thailand, yeah, to have, like, bread for breakfast, because usually people have love rice. to have rice. Yeah. But, well... The reason is quite simple. My mom' favorite food is bread. Bread. So she cooks. <laughs> <laughs> she has, yeah, she always makes sandwich for us. Okay. Like oh, no. croissant I mean... sandwich is so good. Yeah. I want to sh to test the arrow. Oh, I forgot. I just the hair, the arrow still not showing me. No, no, it, it did show, but it at like 5 seconds. I can change it to like 1 second for debugging first, and then change it to 5 seconds later. And then, oh. when you hit the UFO, it will increase the counter, the speed counter. Yeah. Actually, what is everyone's favorite type of bread? I actually love brioche. Wait, what yeah. is that? Brioche is like a kind of bread with a lot of egg yolk and butter Ooh. <laughs> so um i think it is used a lot in hamburger like brioche bun mm. yeah the moving potato love burritos ah talking Rem about burritos every week there must be one game submitted by the guy ah. and in this game we have to collect burritos Wait, is it burritos or taco? <coughs> burritos is taco. Taco shell is not fully wrapped. Wrapping around the. Wait, filling. but oh, wait, but the one in in, in in the guy game is burrito. Is burritos? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I also love croissant. Like croissant is so good. Okay, so when I. Okay, so when I get hit from the flop ball here, we eat A? Where's A? Oh, F, 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 F. Talk about croissant. Can I reduce when you the make speed? bread pudding with croissant, it has so good. Because it's extremely buttery. Oh my god. Really fast. <laughs> <laughs> oh. When I got hit, I press A. And then... Wow! Ooh. Next rain! 70... 76, welcome to the stream! Ah, uh, so... Maybe we can show 
him quickly what we are oh. building right now. Sure. The building looks fun. Thank you. So, right now, I have three tasks to do. Oh my god, this is like really messy. Um, the, the overall gaming, just show the gameplay. <laughs> Oh, show, you mean show the gameplay? Okay, okay, okay. I thought to show yeah, like show what we are doing. First. Okay. Oh, wait, let me remove this one first. I was thinking about how to do the mechanic. Okay. So, right now, uh, we have this Togepi, and it can move left or right. And we have this Diglett that's tied to stop him. Oh no, I saw the bug. Yeah. And, oh, okay, okay, okay. But I, I'll, I'll show, I'll, I'll show the game first. Everyone. <laughs> I just send a bug now. And after getting GBT, you can also send your game to my stream on every uh -huh. Saturday. So you, you want to. Oh my I... god, I self promo so hard. <gasps> oh my god, how come. Because I forgot I to disable this, uh, I forgot to make let's, this. Let's describe the it. bug first. Like, what's the problem right now, Mew? Like, go back, go back, and show the problem. Show the bug. <laughs> well, the bug so is, what is the bug right now. The bug is uh, Diglett colliding with the jump pad. No, no, not 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 jump pad, but the speed pad. Oh, so the speed pad spins like crazy. Yeah, because and both the also starts to spin like crazy. Both of them share the same uh teleport exit. Yeah. So yeah, and both of them are how should I say it? Solid. So it's collide. Which uh. means that I have to make it non-solid and change to a zero gravity. And I have to change the speed mechanic. Actually, I noticed the rotation. I think just now, sir, also mentioned this earlier. Like, do you reset the physics at the teleport exit? Yes. Ah, really? Mm. But no, how but come? okay. If you think about it, they are two solid objects. Oh, at the teleport exit. Okay. Yes. So I have to do that to disable solid. So the only solid part is the dig one. But then now here come the issue. The issue is that um, if I got hit by the dig red, wait, why why is it not going? Oh, I have to change the fancy object to be zero gravity as well. Yeah. So when you use the not solid. You have to change your uh, material to zero gravity so that it will not fall off the ground. Mm. So right now they should not be bug, but there's also a chance yeah. that uh, the arrow actually on top of the diglet. Wait, I saw I saw the arrow. And oh wait. The arrow gets rotated again because of the teleport. Like... Oh, the teleport actually reset the rotation. Oh no! Okay, okay, okay. Okay. Um... So right now, the book is like um, the first time we see the the arrow, right? The arrow is parallel to the floor, but after it gets teleport once. The arrow becomes orthogonal to the floor. Yeah, it becomes. How is Mew going to fix this? Oh my god, there, there are two bugs it's now. This okay. exciting! Wow! <laughs> what are what is the other bug? Actually, the well, the 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 other bug is that if I get hit, the arrow will not stop moving. Like, uh -huh. I got hit, and then the arrow still go. Okay. And that is because a non-solid object with a zero input is still keep the final speed. Which means that I have to reverse the speed. 
So even though the input here is zero, I want to also input the speed. Okay, let's let's fix. The Why do you want? Oh, because the zero gravity object will continue moving. Yes. Even when the the speed input is zero, so you cannot stop it. Mm -hmm. Unlike um decret decret material is not zero gravity, so when the speed is zero, it will stop. Hmm, that's correct. Huh. So I'm going to add a speed sensor here. Yeah, I had to make it. <laughs> hmm? Our master is saying something again. <laughs> the arrow should be rotated if it's not on the bottom of the connection group. What do you mean, but but up the bottom of connection group? Yeah. You mean connect? On a different one, like connect it like this. Ah, uh, no. I have to connect it. It has to be the, the, the. What is it called? The the moving object has to be the base. Otherwise, it's not here. Yeah, right now we are trying to figure out like um. I mean that there are two ways to, to do not that. rotate the arrow. So what are the two ways that you have in white? One in, way is to rotate. In mind. One way is to rotate using a hinge. Hmm. So that's, yeah, that's straightforward. Uh huh. Which means that. Which means that okay. Uh. Because I have to rotate it back. But, so it said, the teleporter only fixed the rotation of the bottom most object in a connection group. It needs to be connected on top of another object. So the arrow, does this mean the arrow has to be connected on top of like this? Wait, but right now the arrow is connected on mm. top of I mean, this this object will, will get reset, but this object will not get reset. So unless I connect, I I. Um, oh, I yeah. got it. But so, maybe you can explain explain it further more. Ah, uh, like I should say, it, like there's a hierarchy, right? The one if you connect. So the base object is the one that have no bottom connection. This base object, when you get teleport, it will reset the rotation. The object that is connect that is not the base will keep the rotation. But because it's actually connect to the object at center to center, uh, whatever rotation it will not change. So, so said okay at this no it should it, it's not okay right i mean the well, let me let me change the like right now right now it's actually perpendicular to the ground right so i i change it to like 90. Actually, what about you rotate the teleport exit no i cannot because it actually also teleport the dick oh okay so right now, yeah. Okay. So yeah, so so this one has to be zero, and then I change, uh, I change, um, the object to be like point one, point six, and then, oh, okay, this might be, hmm, the arrow will actually. If you use zero gravity, the, mm, but it's okay if the, if if the arrow is actually above the ground because uh, the center of the teleport is actually above the ground. It's at the center of the diglet, so it's actually 0.4 meter above the ground. Mm. 
Hmm. So I change it. Oh no, it has to be 3.6. Which means that this is the base. Hmm? Where is it? Not 5.6. Oh, because I forgot to hit. Right. So this is the base. And I can. So it's still connecting it. Uh, directly, I have a hinge. Connection hinge. What is the hinge? Is C hinge? Hmm. C hinge. So I connect uh, the arrow to C hinge. And the C hinge to a moving object. And for C hinge, I set it to 90 degree. So, with this, it should. It should be. Mm -hmm. That's right. And then I can. Okay. Uh -huh. so uh, the... Thank you for your wish. And see you soon. Yep, the left one is. Actually, correct now. Huh. Okay, the the middle one is okay. The middle one is back. Okay, that's good. So this solution work. So by keeping it with our rotation, I change the side to be the same as the arrow when it's on the ground. And uh, wait. Do I need to change the sensor as well? Oh, do I need to change the sensor? Yes, I need to send change the sensor to be the same size. So x is by six, and then this is by eight. So that I actually touch the arrow. Okay. And then for this one, I just add hinge. And I connect the arrow to the hinge and then the hinge to the moving object. This should fix everything. Hopefully. Shakira Waffle Cat! Yay! Congrats! But Phil, we have got more time until the deadline. Feel free to modify and add more features and resubmit the game if you want. Yeah. And so it asks, so what would be the benefit? For to the player if they touch the speed pad. The benefit would be you just go faster. It Wouldn't mean it mean I would die faster? But you can fight faster. That's not <laughs> That's not really convincing me. Like I die fast, I can point. I will die faster. Or maybe I add points for like connecting because right now the, the bonus point <laughs> The bottom part is from like you spinning, and when when you spin, you cannot move. So you, at the beginning, ah. you can spin a lot, but then after you collect, like after the time pass, then you actually have to uh, to decide whether you want to like spin or <laughs> you want to just dodge. Yeah, I see, I see. But I think from the gameplay that you show us like last time. After mm -hmm. collecting the speed pad, Togepi also moved to the front. Yes, right? I have not done that yet, but I plan to do. But, but actually, when that happens, it's going to be even harder to dodge. Really. Uh huh. Right. Yes. So, I think it's it's more harmful. It's more harmful. Than, yeah, because Togepi would move to the front. And it's going to be eventually like harder to dodge all those uh, 
าติเกรตอ uh, so like maybe you have to add more benefits of collecting arrows I mean just add point would be sufficient no so last time yeah you will to rack up more point the longer it takes for the speed to become impossible yeah maybe I add a score multiplier oh like nice yeah so score multiplier for a short period of time. But when I'm, I'm faster, when I spin, I get more points. Oh my god, this is gonna okay. make the game very really hard. But yeah, yeah, I could Actually, do that. Ron also suggested another interesting idea last time. Ah. It's like instead of having HP bar, right? Each time you got, each time you get hit by a diglet, Tokepi would move back slightly. Uh -huh. But and but when you get the speed pad, your Tokepi would move towards the front, and the game would end when Tokepi gets pushed far to the back. So that would mean just adding the life here, right? That would work, right? So right now I get hit, I decrease the counter. So if I collect the speed pad, I increase the counter. Yeah, that's also that's. Yeah, this that means that you have more life when you when you pick up. I mean, if you collect the speed pad, then uh, yeah, you can get more hit from the dick that. Yeah. Uh, goodbye, Shanti. That's also one way. Okay, so PJ asked mm. did you submit my game. Is it to Dom stream? I'm not sure if Dom has opened the stream. Oh, code. I see. Yeah. So yeah, so mm, PJ, you can ah, you can. Yes, oh, really? Okay, sure. Did you comment like the you are like game code? Then I think Jay can submit for you. I think. Yeah, 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 yeah. You already told me that. I will do that later. Yo. Okay, so where am I again? Ah, uh, I often forget. <laughs> Okay, let me make the arrow over here. So when I collect the arrow, I increase the speed as well as I increase the life. It's going to be a long connection. Maybe I use wormhole. Maybe L for life. Okay. <laughs> I add life. Yeah. Alpha life. Alpha life. And then I have entrance here. Where are all the entrance? Okay, one over here. I like to copy because I actually forget where it is. <laughs> I mean if it's it's easier to find on the programming screen instead of like find down here. So maybe I, I I actually start with like negative life and if I got hit first then I die. Hmm, that could be interesting. So right now I I set it so that after three hit I die. Hmm Yeah but it it, it could also work with like three life. But I want to use life as the the position as well. Hmm. Hmm. What do you mean? Can you elaborate? What do you mean by um using life for Z position? And Zach Davy, thank you so much for your kind words. So right now you you have all it at this position. So if I yeah. gain life, I move it forward. If I lose life, I move it backward. Oh, so I think you can map the life point to C position, right? Hmm. That's what I plan to do. And let's say when the yeah, and you need to send the signal to forward, backward, 
mm-hmm. of the UFO until yes. the C the, 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 the yeah, location is word. correct. That's right. That's uh-huh. right. Okay, but I have to f- fix the second bug of the speed pad first before I I I do the live here. Maybe I do the live after that. Um, so for to reward this, I can use the same thing as I use as this move the the number object, which is I have like a speed connected to the creator, and if I get by a flop ball, I inverse the speed um mm-hmm. yeah that's about it yeah should we only increase the speed so the score is the speed ah okay okay that that works i guess mm-hmm. Okay, which means that I need a speed sensor and also an inverse and also a multiply. Okay, let me copy the speed sensor. So each of these objects, um, I can detect the speed and I try to reverse the speed. So I space sensor connect to the moving object. And and I do multiply. Mm-hmm. I have to do two multiply and then I put Why? It to, oh, what I mean is like, each one for? Uh the original multiply is for the speed, the actual speed. Another multiply is the inverse. inverse what speed. is the inverse for? To stop. <gasps> Aha. So yeah, to to stop a moving object that is not solid and zero gravity, you actually need to inverse the speed. So we have inverse the speed. And then I got hit by flop ball. And this flop ball. Alright. They can be down here. Oh, but I, really, I, I already have the negative already here. So I don't need the inverse here. I just multiply and then I apply the negative. Wait, am I correct? Ah, oh, yeah, 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 I multiply the negative. I multiply minus one to the speed and then I put it back. All right, all right. So I don't need a flop ball here. Flop ball can stay there. And then I can move this. This inverse. This was work, working very hard. So I put yes. the inverse here. Indeed. I put the speed there. And then I connect to the moving object. So it, if I got hit by flop ball, then this will be mi minus one, and the minus one hundred speed will be the inverse. Mm. Mm. And I do this for every object. Minus six, and then I connect it to C here. All right. Okay, and then I can pull this one back. Okay, let's see if it actually stop moving. Nice. So it start. It stop moving now. Oh, but I got hit by two dog did at one, so I die. <laughs> <laughs> really? Oh yeah. Ah, see, I I actually. Ah. Oh, but I should I should oh, have. Oh no, you haven't set the maximum HP. Oh yeah. Oh, I got out the HP. It's so ugly. <laughs> what is that big R? No, but like <gasps> how how would I do that? 
How would be the maximum? You can set the range of the counter, right? Can can we see the counter range? But if I if I HP. Yeah, but if I if I be in front, I get hit. My HP will still be full, right? Because I have extra heal from the speed pack. No, 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 no. You go to the counter setting. The counter for HP. Uh huh. Mm hmm. And. You just set it to range. Set to range. Yeah. And what is your maximum HP? Infinity. Huh? No. You can go. No you can, HP cannot be. You can go to the front. In, in, indefinitely. But like if 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 I do no, that, right? No, it's not right? indefinitely. Like, I mean, you cannot go beyond the front of the screen. But because, I like at but, that point you cannot see Togepi anymore. But I am not at the front so, of the screen when I start, which means that my HP is not full at the start, right? No, your HP, it should have at some value. Okay, like let's say the starting position is like two, and max is five. Yeah, but which the is the display the is to the screen. The display will be two at the beginning of the game. So in that case, you can set maximum HP to be like six, or something like that. So initially it's two, at zero it dies. And at 6, 6 is the max HP. Which means that at, at the start, I'm not at full HP, right? No. Oh. It depends on how you decide the game. Hmm, I want to try to... Because like, at the beginning, like, my, my, my HP bar is actually not full, right? Because I can gain HP more. Maybe I can have using but a range. It's strange. Hmm? It's quite strange to uh, to start a game with um I don't know with not full HP. I oh, I can do range enable. So mm. if I go beyond, I still display at zero. I mean, I I still display at full. But then. That would have the same the bug that you mentioned earlier, like when it's at front. Let's switch to the pad, the mm -hmm. jamboard. The jamboard, okay. Which page? H four. H four. Okay. So this is the track, right? Mm, the track. And Tokepi starts here. Yes. So, at here, at this position, mm. what is the HP? Three. Three? Yes. Then after it collects, and the bar... This is this is gonna be the length of the bar, okay? Uh, yeah, sh it should be. HP bar at top. Should be full. Then, after collecting the speed pad, mm -hmm. Togepi would move here. Yes. Right. Mm -hmm. What is its HP here? Well, it can be like. I'm not. I have not do the calculation yet. Like. Just, Be just add some, some Be number. Yeah, maybe six, I guess. Six, and HP bar at the top. Four, the same as Four. the HP three. Then, next, it is hit by a decret. Hmm. Pew. So in this case, because HP is six, right? Okay, it will become. But the HP bar will it still show at four? Yes. Because, yeah, then that is very strange. Or is it not strange? I mean, if it above because three, this, it, it means like at HP three to six, the HP bar, P bar will be shown as four bar. I think that is okay, right? Because uh, at three plus uh, at three plus HP, everything is shown as just three. 
but if okay, you sure. if you are like about to die it will actually shorter shorten okay so when it gets hit by the grid will this one move back a lot no it will move to uh, the position where the hp is five oh okay yeah yeah that's that's what i mean by move back so after it gets hit by a decklet it will move to where hp equal to five mm -hmm. yes right okay hmm. yeah i think this is fine yeah but I, hmm. i'm not sure like so for HP example only decrease like if HP. if the player is really <laughs> good like it keep uh collecting the speed pad maybe the hp can just go up or uh, up but no, but, but 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 the it location the maximum, though. should it otherwise the game um i mean every game have maximum hp right uh-huh almost every games hmm but it but this yeah. will be the, the endless run so even the no but like know. it's your game so yeah hmm i mean the the speed will keep like the speed will be very high hmm i, I haven't decided like what would be the speed for or like after getting hit is it going to be minus one or like reset back to to one mm. like if it if it reset back to one then yeah having a maximum hp is a good idea and that also means that i need to actually show that uh if you collect more after this then there should not be like you you will not gain benefit only when mm. you are not at max HP. Yeah. So I mean, it's become a decide choice whether or not I want to be to have a maximum HP or not. If I have, if I want to make have a maximum HP, then the HP bar should have some telling to the player that you actually hit the max. But if I decide that um, I think the position of the Tokepi has already told you that told you whether you are at the max HP or not. Right. But for the player who play at the first for the first time They will not know, right? They they keep can you like if you kill in the speed pad and the location does not move forward, that means you keep the max. Is that intuitive? Yeah, I think so. I mean, of course, it cannot keep moving forward until like it disappears from the camera, right? Yes, but that also does that also translate to maximum HP? Yeah. Mm. Yes. <laughs> okay. I mean, the user will learn, right? Like, okay. I have collected more and more speed pad, but like nothing happened. Or you can actually add like some sound effect that um the speed pad is in effect. Like for example, there is like sparkling effect when you are at the we are when you don't have the max HP and you collect the speed pad. But um when you add max hp and you collect the speed pad actually no i have a or no visual effect ah. that's also possible actually i want to have like a different idea i mean collecting the speed pad mm. and getting hit by a diglet will move you up move you front or backward but your hp is always three and okay you when you get a speed pad right you also get your health back if it's not full uh-huh so i think that would be the best 
option so hp is still three but if you keep if you get uh maybe there'll be a, a different reward when you you collect the speed pad when you hp is full otherwise when you collect the speed pad when you hp is not full then you will be uh you, you get your hp increase yeah, so I'm actually confused, Mew. Like, what will happen? Um, it seems like there are many states here, like a lot of if else. Mm hmm. Yeah. yeah. Yes, it will have. So maybe can you summarize that? Sure. <laughs> into a dagger oh. or something. Or like into a visual. Oh, S max HP. Uh. Oh, okay. Let, 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 let me do... It's like HP. So, like, at the initial position, does this consider as max HP? Yes. So, the the location and HP is actually not so this related. So, one is... Per se. So, like, my drawing is invalid, right? Because your max HP is going to be only mm -hmm. 3. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So, let's just restart the drawing. So no, that you we can, will not you confuse can. with this one. Because from this one, like if you keep using my drawing, right? The max HP is six. Uh-huh. Yeah, but um you are saying that your max HP is only three, which is at the starting position. Hmm. 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 So let's start a new board and okay. explain your idea. <laughs> and thank you so much, Revolving Potato, for liking the Togepi model. Okay, so. So, hit. So, this is gonna be. Okay. So, this one is going to be the HP. And then. um, So, getting hit, hit by Diglett. Uh huh. And then collect speed pad. So at so there will be one, two, three, and the maximum is three. Okay. So this one you gain a bonus, right? It's also the position. Ah, sure, sure, sure. Yeah, yeah. And let's say. Um no Oh my god we don't no. have enough space. No no we we we, we don't need a, a a position. The position will be leader heap. To what? To um yeah yeah I I will show you why. So first I get hit by a diglet when HP is three and that's gonna be like HP minus one and um, location so minus one become... but the location will have oh. a different counter so the, lo the the location will have the maximum and minimum okay mm -hmm. and yeah. okay so it will be the same for all of them actually so like hp minus one location minus one hp minus one location minus one and this one is game in right okay and then when i do the yeah. collect speed pad i get a bonus point and location plus one but when i'm at two i got the like hp uh oh wait hold on hp plus one hp plus one and then this also hp plus one but location Location only increase when you are uh, at max HP. Mm. Okay. In that case, you know what, Mew? I have feeling that um when you are not at max HP, right? Yes. Instead of using the arrow symbol, you should use like heart symbol instead. 
I don't know it's quite confusing. Like, hard. Is it different shape? When? I, I, I cannot, I... Hmm... You can use texture. Texture instead of drawing? So instead of have using the actual fancy object? Yeah. Because I feel like... I don't know why it's quite confusing. It's like, sometimes I collect the speed pad, but like, I do not move forward. However, sometimes when I collect speed pad, I move forward. I think this one is more confusing for me. Do you understand? Mm. Like, so like, from a player perspective, I feel like, okay, like, hey, why do I move forward when I collect the speed pad this time? But when my HP is 1, I do not understand why I do not move forward. And I would think your code is bug. That's my idea. I see, I see. Right, I will blame. Oh my god, this game is so buggy. I don't think you will do that. <laughs> it doesn't move forward. <laughs> I mean, I'm, I'm not doing that when I actually. Yeah, I'm I'm kinder when I play other games. Oh, except my game. game. Okay. Yeah. And what is this song movies? I actually don't know. <laughs> it's one of the Pokemon songs. But I I don't exactly know what theme it is. And revolving potato suggests or maybe a heart with an arrow up symbol on the heart. Yeah. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I think the speed pad has to be clearer on like we have to be clearer on like what yeah, the speed pad. Right. Initially, I, I I just want the speed pad to change the speed, but not the HP. But then, if we want to combine, uh, yeah, that idea of then yeah, we have to change the design, which I yeah. have not thought about it just now <laughs> yeah because I, I i i don't plan to include it right so now that i have to include it then i have to think about what would be yeah the best for the player mm. yeah hmm uh... What if I just... What? Yeah, plus... Yeah, what plus, if you just... Plus location of them. But the HP is just... Maybe... I show... Just the texture for the HP. On top of the Togepi head. When I collect speed pad. What do you mean? <laughs> again, again, again. Like when I collect the speed pad, like I have... Sometimes I... I I got hard, sometimes I got points. Then maybe I have like a texture on top of Hokapi head. And when I collect those, I just show the texture. That I collect oh. this speed pad, but also I got it hard. Like similar to case. similar to when it got hit and then there has a, a star on top of the head. Okay, okay. In that case I have feeling that the the design of the it's more like the speed pad has become mysterious item more than just a speed pad. Uh -huh. So I don't think you should use arrow fancy objects. It becomes more like a mysterious item box. Then to keep it simple, I that... just remove HP. Yeah, I think so. I think it's simple to remove HP, yeah. Uh, yeah, and just like if I collect the speed pad, I go up. If I get hit by a diglet, I go down. Yeah. Yeah, and um, and then the question would be, what would be the benefit of so that of, of uh, collecting the speed pad? Of course, we can move forward, right? And then we can get more hits by the glitch. Uh huh. But it would be, I don't know, like. 
It will also have the same effect if you wait out until it reaches the same speed. Which is maybe Why? safer? I'm not sure. Uh, is that what, so, okay, what, 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 what? Right now we are talking about the last design, which is so we don't have HP anymore. Mm -hmm. So, like for 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 the ori for for the or original game, like you collect speed pad because you want to get to the goal faster. Yeah. And now the game become endless run, which means that the speed pad need. A different purpose. Mm. So maybe. Hmm. But I think. Um. This is just my idea. Can you go to the next slide? Okay. So we start at zero location, right? This is where we start. Mm -hmm. So each time we collect speed pad. We move forward. Mm -hmm. But when we get hit, we move backwards. And if we are at negative two, we will get game over. Mm -hmm. So this one, I think the benefit benefit of getting speed pad is pretty clear, right? I mean, like let's say if I collect two speed pads, I can get hit by the grids like four or five times. Uh huh. But that means that um the HP bar is not necessary anymore. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So like just remove the HP bar. Okay. But Max Brain has another idea. This is idea three. <laughs> we have got so many ideas today. What is Max Brain idea, Mew? Can you read out? Hmm? Max Brain has suggested an idea. To make land, like, you could build a separate HP program, then save that to use on any game. Oh, you mean like making a different game? Oh. Yeah, I think so. Maybe like another mini game with Togepi character. Uh huh. Yep. Is that what you mean? That what Rain said, right? Yeah. But I think for this one, we can remove HP bar. Actually, this idea, I think like when Ron suggested us last time, I think he also mentioned this idea that we don't need HP bar. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I see, I see. Just keep moving back and forth. And what happens if I collect a speed pad when I'm at 2? Nothing will happen. But it's... I think in this case, it's quite understandable because Tokipi is already like... um Very close to the camera. So of course, it cannot move even more, even further more. Right. But the question is, will the speed of everything change? Or the speed pad only affect the location. I think it's. I don't know. I feel like I have spoken too much. Yeah. Hmm. Because right, right now they are. You should answer that. Your... <laughs> huh? <laughs> <laughs> you should answer that question by yourself. Your own question. You answer it. Yeah. So I'm. I'm still thinking. Right. They are. Actually, like two two kind of speed, right? Um, one is like Togepi going up and down, and another is actually the speed of the Diglett. So right now, mm. the game right now is like I collect a speed patch, but the Togepi doesn't move yet, but the speed of everything increase when I collect a speed patch. 
Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I want mm -hmm. to have both. But yeah, then you can have both. Yes. Then what? Oh my god, I feel like I'm really harsh here. I was like, then what? Tell me. <laughs> <laughs> the the issue is just that um if I got hit early, I don't want to reset my speed to zero to like stop the game. So maybe actually when I got hit by a diglet, I okay, so if I got hit by diglet, I reset speed. Uh um this is your speed graph. Right. Speed. Like this. Right? Mm hmm So let's say... Currently, you are at this speed now. And then, you got hit by a diglet. No, I was talking right? at, 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 at this spot. Uh, let me write. Like, if I'm at this spot and I get hit by a diglet, yeah. Then I should so, be at that spot again. Yes, I think so. But if I'm at you should not at this spot, then I go back. Okay. Yeah. That's fine, right? But I mean, there would be a short animation when where everything stopped for a short moment before we. Continue at this speed. Yes. Yeah. So mm. like what is the current problem? Uh. Actually. Like, like, so like, I don't understand why, what, what, what is the current problem? The current problem is yeah. it become costly. That's it. I mean, you have so many nodons left. Yeah, I I try to would think. Would it be costly? I, I would try to think like I I would try to I like, optimize, but I mean it. The the, the problem is not the, the like actually it's not doable. But actually like very doable. Uh, I was trying to like find like the easy way that I can just like minus one, but actually does not go below this threshold. But oh. I see. Yeah, but I mean, your first solution mm. can also be just minus one, right? Maybe not. No yeah, need but to come back to these points, like this point. No, but like if I'm at at this point, I it, it has to be minus zero. That's the only concern. I mean, but I mean we can use like condition if it this value, then we don't actually decrease the speed. Oh, okay. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Why is Shanghai the waffle cat feel like he's a god here? Yeah. <laughs> By the way, for the Gothic phone stream, um, if you check my community tab, right, you can actually download animations. Ah, you have put it in, in the... the game. Yeah. Okay. Yes. So Go I to think the community tab, tab and download them all. Okay, let let's go to make it simple. Right? Let's go with the design. So, yeah, got hit. I so I got hit and then I got speed. We'll do the opposite of going back and forth. And for the speed here, um, to keep it simple, it's only controlled by time. Mhm, mm mhm. Mm controlled by time. And if I got ah. hit, I reset it to 1. Okay. Mm -hmm. If got hit, then reset to 1. Mm. Yeah. Okay. 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 So let's. <laughs> <laughs> I still remember, like. Um, before the stream starts, I asked Mew, mm, what are you going to do today? 
music, speed hat, title, and ending screen. Mm-hmm. I mean, it, it's good to have a long plan, right? In case you finish early. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's go back. And yeah, thank you for drawing that out for me. <laughs> uh. Wait, where should I start? So <laughs> right now, so right now I have to remove, um. The one that increased the speed <laughs> because I don't need to increase the speed anymore. The speed will only um control by time. Uh huh. And and what else? <laughs> I forgot what I have to do. Uh, where did I finish my O? Yeah, I finished my O, right? So, I have a speed pad. I collect the speed pad. Oh, I mean, yeah, I increase the life, and if I get hit, I decrease the life. Okay, which means that um, I can now plan to put the UFO at the correct position. Let me check. And I didn't disconnect. Oh. Is it back now? Yeah, we are back. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for Why yeah the it hiccup. Disconnected again. Um, I actually was like connected to the uh, my university VPN when I was working because I have to access um. The domain specific server. Ah. Yeah. That's that's why. Yeah. Maybe. Then the VPN got disconnected. Uh huh. Yeah. The VPN suddenly got disconnected, and also I also got disconnected from the internet for a little bit. But I think it should be fine now. Uh huh. And I think yes, just screen become is black. Disappeared. <laughs> okay. So. Yeah. So what we are trying to do now is trying to see like what we'll would be. Recover my screen first. Wait, how, how do I recover your skin? In OBS, in, um, in Electron, just disconnect mm. and then connect it again. No, but... Oh, okay, okay. In the Electron. Yeah. I'll go back. Or go to the homepage. <laughs> most, most of the time, it's, um, it's the stream problem side of... <laughs> I also face a lot of technical issues from time oh, to time. Oh, I think... Is this correct? Yeah. Yeah, it's correct. Okay, okay. Mute, mute, mute my window as well. Mute? Um, hmm? right click electron show control bar and then mute. Oh. Show control bar. Mute. Yes. Okay, 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 okay. Nice. Okay, how you fix? Oh my god, I, I am the cause of your technical difficulty. Normally it's going to be there, but... Normally it's myself, I mean. Yeah. yeah. Now I, I, I contribute to one time difficult difficulty. <laughs> Alright, so right now we are... I'm trying to like um, see what would be the the location of the front. And then I can... Like, maybe this one. So we have... Okay, so this one should be... Yeah, and you can see the diglet very close to you. So this would be the two position. Okay, let me write out some number. Wait, my okay. So at this two would be the actual value of the position. It should be C, right? Okay. We see what's 1.6. Okay. And then the fertile position probably be like just about the end of the line. Be here. 
Uh huh, yeah, I, we can do that. So what is the location here? And then we can do uh, interpolation. So the minus 2 is 8.8. Which means that the difference is 7.2. And 7.2... 1, 2, 3, 4... Can be divisible by 4, yay! Which means... Nice! My god, this is like so much magic. So if it is divisible by 4, then I do like plus. Plus what? Actually, I can just map like minus 2 to the 8.8 .8 and then 2 to 1.6 using a map. <laughs> yeah. That would be, yeah, that would be. You can do that. Yeah, yeah, that would be a lot easier to do the math here. <laughs> I'm trying to avoid right math. Mm. Okay, let me change. Okay, oh, I already it. Then. Okay. So right now, um, the speed pad is pretty much done. Oh uh, no 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 not 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 done. I mean, yeah the the movement of the speed pad, but the speed mechanic is not done yet. Okay, so I have the UFO at so okay. Let me find the middle point first. The middle point would be uh three point six. 5.2 okay maybe at 5.2 uh huh okay so this is the middle oh my god my end is actually in the middle of the ufo okay so now j has like two chicken a and b Okay, uh... Hey, come on in and keep toys. Welcome, yeah, long... And you are back at the right time. Right now we have J-Jam ongoing and... You are more than welcome to join us. And right, Royal uh... has posted some Italian spill taste again. What? Kirby E Moto Carino A Iwatente. Is there something about Curly? How about Kirby? I think so. Yeah, but Kermani, since you're here, have you got a new GBT project? Do you want to share something with us? Okay, so I have the location map and then because of the counter is okay from zero I can map mm -hmm. I can use a map to map the location So what it so the negative two to two and it should be the reverse right eight point eight and one point six reverse yeah probably enable and that would be the C location and then I can do uh, the location sensor on the UFO Okay. Location sensor. So right now, yeah, if you look at the blue screen on the right, <laughs> Mew is going to make Tokepi move backward and oh, forward. Yeah, forward. So like Tokepi will move forward when after collecting the speed pad, but it will move backward after getting hit by a diglet. Mm -hmm. Right? Yeah. So, 
with the magic of location nodon, location sensor, and the map. I can do the minus. So right now, we hmm. is finding the difference between the yeah. target location yeah, the target and, and the current location. We see yes, and then if it's not zero, but if it's, but I the target is greater than which means I have to move backward yeah which is negative negative yes negative so it will move backward oh okay okay let, let, let's try this so I move yeah over actually backward. it's quite simple though like you can you just try if it's incorrect if it works, yeah. you just swap the inputs so if I click on hit by here no it doesn't move Wait. backward Oh! Okay, be moved forward move just forward now. Just now, but but it does not move back. So it when it it get a jump pad, it move forward. But when it didn't, it move forward a bit too much, though. Don't you think? Mm hmm. Right. Yes. No, no. But I, I, it, it's like two HP, so it's like when it get one. And then two, and this is going to be the the very font should be here. Ooh. But then I got hit by okay. a diglet somehow. I didn't go back. <laughs> yeah. Why? Hmm. That's interesting. So for the diglet, right? For the diglet. Yeah. This counter decrease. Mm hmm. So when it decreased, the location will be higher. No, no, the 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 target will be higher. Will be the negative. Range restriction is now enabled. Oh yeah, but I think it should be enabled. Mm, yeah, yeah, it should Correct. be enabled. Because otherwise, it would move, um, like beyond the camera. <laughs> but why? Why is the negative is not? Hmm. Doesn't work. Why the negative doesn't work? How about you output the counter value into the number node on and you put the number node on, on the screen so that you see the value. Oh, but wait. You can use the number yeah. node on. Uh, should be the upper so of the map. We know. No, just counter. Okay. Just check the counter value. Yeah, first, like one by one. If so, yeah, the zero. counter. Yeah, start from zero. Then I got yes, hit. then we get hit by the diglet. Oh, it's wait. still zero. Wait, is it because? Let's check. Oh, it's range. Yeah. Hmm? Third says, <laughs> why is up recent again? When in doubt, number no done. <laughs> <laughs> okay, okay. So the range should be from, yeah, just negative D to 3. Yeah. Okay, that should work. Okay. Oh, I got hit. Ah. So now the game end condition. Oh no, 3 decrets. <laughs> and yes. Yep. Nice. Wait, wait. Did you see mm. the the, the see arrow that. move forward? <laughs> I see that. I see that. <laughs> it will oh be fixed. I mean, it, it will be fixed later. I mean, it's the end of the game, right? Anything can happen. But uh, yeah, I fix later. Ooh. Actually, you know what? When the game ends, you can just destroy everything. <laughs> yeah, everything should be disappear. <laughs> destroy everything on the treadmill, and like all the bugs are gone. Uh -huh. huh. That's true. Alright, I think. Mm. Let me try one more time. Try to get the speed pad to make going up. Okay, then I got hit by going down. Ooh. And then I collect the speed pad. No, no, just just play it forever until you die. Oh Wait! No. Oh no! It doesn't go back. No, because I of your HP range, it's still maxed. 
Oh, I should change it to max too. Oh, I should change it to max too. Yeah. Ah, okay, okay. So right. So I mean, there's a chance that the arrow and the dicklet is on the at at at, at the same position. So I collect. Yeah. So we collect, collect. Collect, collect, collect. Oh my god. Ah, got hit. But because you are quite my lucky, I feel like when I play your game, I will only get dicklet, and I will not get arrows. Oh my god. <laughs> I think we will cheat for sure. Like he will keep one coin himself with a lot of um arrows, and then uh -huh. for, for the public code, for the yep. public code will have a lot of necklets. Oh my god! Now that oh my god. now the speed. Yeah, I think we should we should keep the speed fast so that um it's actually harder instead of resetting the speed because yeah. Otherwise, it will go on like, forever. So I mean, why not I you, mean, you reset run. the speed, right? No, no, I didn't reset the speed. Oh. So I think I, I, I should keep it this way. Wait. Okay, okay. I think the speed had appear appears too often. Uh huh. It's every five, every, every five. Wait, is it? Yeah, it's more than five. I understand why. Because why the the random number. Still at that location. Still, still act activate the same uh, blue eyes. So when the path got teleport back, it automatically activate again. Like when when the the, the this time travel is less than five okay. seconds. No. So on the counter setting, can you change to like on on change instead of white? Hmm? Go to the counter settings. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's on change from zero already. Okay. Yeah, because when I when I hit the the panel the the fancy object at the end, I I I have to reset because I don't want it to move. <laughs> but then the blue eyes will activate it again. So it's asking, is it intentional that two and three at the same location? So it's two card. I mean, instead of asking, is it a bug? Asks, yeah, I I, I had to change it to like two two <laughs> minus three. <laughs> and it was so me like, is it a bug? <laughs> mm -hmm. No, but like I think this one, um, I think it's okay at as of now, and. This one I can fix the timing later, like, hmm. like after play two. Like, so for the current problem, how would you fix it though? Like, problem of the arrow chance. Uh, well, I initially I want to like one of them to activate at a time. So Gee, maybe like you can use 2D marker. I don't know. 2D. I I can use a diff a diff like a different timer. So right now, actually, I both of them are at one second speed, right? Because for testing, I want the arrow to appear oh. a lot so that I can do the debug. But in the real game, it's gonna be five seconds. But even so, ah. I can like when I activate five seconds, I can try to uh like having like one second to reset the random after like I, I want I want it to like random mm, but I have to redo this but yeah so essentially I, I have to have uh, I want to random one number at five second mark and then be yeah. beyond that I, I, I reset yeah okay and hi Lepi Gamer yeah so right now we are making the speed pad for Muse Tokepi game. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I think we might. I think. Yeah, this. I think this is done for the speed pad. Actually, I mean, it does what it has to do, right? Um, by like going up and going down, the red is just like polishing. 
and the uh, yeah with the life and also the location mm. Mm. okay yeah yeah so ah, and kid toy cool you can make a jam game actually right now we have like the jam event uh -huh. yeah you can check ongoing the event uh in the link in the description also you can yes. also pause it now but yeah yeah let's do this play through one more time actually let's adjust the timer a little bit and then like do one more round of play through sure so i adjust the timing to be the, the five yeah, seconds Olympic gamer as well yay yay your game is looking so good now compared to mine <laughs> i have all right so one chicken Okay, let's see. So, the first one come here, and then I correct the speed, and then I go to the front. Oh, I missed that speed. Ah, oh, and then I got hit, and then I come back. Oh, oh my god, that's like two tickets at <laughs> no, the same you time. No, you the speed pad first. Don't die yet. Okay, let me get the speed pad. Okay, I move up. Yeah! And then... Oh no, I got hit again. Okay. Okay, has the speed increased? Yeah. You know what? I don't feel that the speed has increased that much because of the floor texture. Oh yeah. So the floor texture has has the same speed. So like let's say, yeah. Hmm. They usually use like a armor on 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 a different armor until I. No. Until I. I, I think. Oh no, I Shouldn't hit. it be a moving object instead for the floor? It could be. <gasps> no, don't get me. Don't okay. die yet. Where, where is the work speed pad? Okay, speed pad, speed pad, speed pad. Yeah. Oh no. <laughs> Wait, I think. Yeah, there's a bug with the speed pad. It actually increased the counter by two instead of one. Oh wow. Oh no. Me, you don't die. Go to the front, go to the front, go to the no. front. Oh my god, it's good. <laughs> yeah, I got like 250. Well, actually, the effect is really cool. For like, the number moved to the front. Uh huh. Yeah, but it's only moved to the front when, when, when no the arrow. end came. Yeah, but when the arrow moved to the front, it's it looks bad. Mm -hmm. But when the number moved to the front, it actually looks. Yeah. Max Ren asks Can you do a solid back background? So the game pops. So a solid back background. So the game pop more. Uh yeah. I mean, you can like change it to like the nice scene. Right now, I I didn't do anything to the world not on yet. The nice scene, the whole thing will get dark candle if you use the nice scene. Ah, I see. Maybe I don't know. Add like a black box or something. I think. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, that would be do at the, the last uh the last step. Yeah. Okay, so, so I think um yeah th this is it for today. <laughs> I think I have done yeah. a lot. Actually we have been like live for like two almost three hours without a break. <laughs> But yeah. So but for me, my chicken has laid beautiful egg oh. instead of ugly eggs like last time. I see, I see. And yeah, I will do death day of my game pretty soon because. Yeah, you, you need it. to make a lot. <laughs> I think your game is like have a lot of mechanic. Like you have. Uh, have yes, like, yeah. You're supposed to have a lot of mechanics, but. <laughs> This, this is what I have got so far, right? Yep, and I think it will be um, even have like polishing more when you stream. <laughs> yeah, no, yes, normally when when is. when one of us stream, um, it can be a little bit difficult to focus on the game, on both game at the same time. But yeah, but I finished some more planning on the paper as well. So. Ah, Yay. nice, 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 and nice. Electric Gamer, thank you for another Thank you. Amazing, keep up the good work because I love it. Yeah. And 
everyone to keep up your good work because we love it. Yeah, we are looking Yay. forward to your submission. Yes. Can wait to play everyone's game. Yes, and you know what? Actually, seeing everyone's update on this call, the fun. <laughs> Uh huh. Yes. <gasps> I really enjoyed it. Like, um, there are so many different ideas, and yeah, let's end. Mm -hmm. yeah, thank you, everyone, for joining. Thank um, you. Let's end the stream and say bye bye to everyone. Oh. Bye bye, Lepi Gamer. Bye bye, movies. Bye, bye Max Rain. Glad to see you here. Yeah, hope to see you again in the future. And bye bye, PJ. Bye, side. Good night. And bye, Kimani and Kid Toys. We'll come back to TBG World and bye Sir. Thanks a lot for all the tips. Mm -hmm. And bye Fabio. Bye Shanking the Waffle Cat. Yes. Bye. Bye. Oh. Yeah, glad to know you. For the yeah. first Thank you, Max Rain, for the subscription. And me for the yes. following. Yes. See you all in the future. Bye bye. Bye bye. Bye-bye.